Hi there, you're now watching Chinese with LTL, and I'm Mavis from Tom Manor with Mavis. Hello, hola, bonjour, ciao, konnichiwa, annyeong. You've guessed it. In this video, we're going to learn some common greetings in Mandarin Chinese. We'll start with the greetings you can use all day long without time constraints. Ni hao. Ni hao is a common Mandarin Chinese usage to greet people. You can translate it loosely as hello or hi in English. Ni hao can be used in both casual and formal situations, but it's usually used with someone who you are not as familiar with. For example, you can greet the person who you are interviewing with for a job, ni hao. Or a bank teller might greet you, ni hao, when it's your turn at the counter. We don't really use it to greet people who we are close with. It sounds a little distant if you greet your best friend, ni hao. People might think you guys are not as close if that's how you interact with each other. To greet those who you are more comfortable or close with, you can say hello. You can already tell hello is a long word from the word hello in English. It's usually used in a casual setting with someone who you are more familiar with. Next, common greetings you can use in both casual and formal situations, but with certain time constraints. Zao or zao an. Zao means early or the morning. An has several meanings, but here it means well. So zao or zao an is the Mandarin Chinese way to say good morning. It's pretty acceptable to greet people zao an from the very early morning all the way through noon. When it's time for lunch, you can switch up your greeting to wu an. Wu means noon or the middle of the day. An here means well. Wu an is the Mandarin Chinese way to say good afternoon. You can use wu an from noon to the early afternoon, like 2 to 3 p.m. But in general, we don't say wu an as often as we use zao an. If you're greeting people past noon, opt for ni hao or hello to sound more natural. There isn't really a term for good evening in Mandarin Chinese, but we do use wan an for the night. Wan means late or late in the day. An here means well. Wan an is the Mandarin Chinese way to say good night. The timing to greet someone one and is usually when you are ending a conversation or saying goodbye at night or right before you're going to bed. Now let's talk about greetings and situations dealing with meeting people. When you meet someone you haven't seen in a while, you say how bu jian. How means so long. Bu jian means haven't seen. How bu jian means it's been a while. When you're saying goodbye to someone, you say zai jian. Zai means again, jian means to meet or to see. The literal translation for zai jian would be see you again, but it's generally the Mandarin Chinese way to say goodbye. Or you can simply say bye bye, a little more from the English word bye bye. If you want to emphasize on the timing to see someone again, you can say xia si jian. Xia si means next or next time, jian means to meet or to see. Xia ci jian is the Mandarin Chinese way to say see you again or see you next time. A couple more very useful greetings for you. Qing, please. At qing, before the action verb you want to use to sound more polite. Xie xie, thank you. Xie xie can be used in every occasion, casual or formal, among strangers or best friends. Don't forget to check out the Chinese with LTL channel for a video dedicated on the ways to say thank you in Mandarin Chinese. 对不起, sorry. Use 对不起 as you will use sorry in English. It can also be used in a formal or casual setting. 不好意思, excuse me. 不好意思 is the Mandarin Chinese way to get people's attention, or a light apology as how excuse me is used in English. If you're looking for online or offline courses to learn the Chinese language, Check out the links in the description box below or go to ltl-school.com for more information. See you next time on Chinese with LTL. Bye!